Ladies and gentlemen, this is not how this video is supposed to start out. I recorded this video two weeks ago talking about ranting the trade deadline. There's a funny skit. I'll play it all after this. But holy f wow. I mean, <laughs> today's Sunday, March 13th. Tomorrow this video comes out on the 14th, the day before my birthday. But Lord have mercy, I just had to turn on the camera real quick after that L that we just took to Miami. My goodness, eight to seven, Garrett Cole, Pitches six innings, allows two runs. The ace does what he has to do, and Clay Holmes just absolutely blows the game away, bro. First blown save in three months. I I just I don't get it, bro. Eight to seven, we had a six to one run, lead. Like I don't get it, bro. It's it's getting worse and worse. And the worst part is that Saturday when we went against Sandy Alcantara, who was supposed to, who's coming off a of Cy Young season, by the way. But the dude just gave up five runs his last outing. And then he puts up a complete game against the Yankees, allowing one run. He played one run ball for nine innings, bruh. We lose three to one on Saturday. And today we have the chance to win our like win a series, finally. We're like, we have a terrible record. We have like a one seven and three record for our last eleven um series. We've won one series. Like this could have been monumental, but nah, nah, nah. Eight to seven. Those are your Yankees. They're ass. They suck. Embarrassing. You've now tuned in to the sounds of Jose. Oh boy, it's six o'clock. Y'all, let's see if the Yankees did anything, man. Come on, Yankees, trade that line. We gotta do something. I mean, <laughs> we suck right now. Either we selling or we buying. Let's see. Come on, Yankees. How we do? Bruh. Who the hell is Keenan Middleton and Spencer Howard, bruh? Yo, I swear to God, bro. <laughs> what the f Welcome back to the Jose channel. My name is Jose. And today we're going to be talking about something very simple. Um, <laughs> Brian Cashman sucks. We all know this, ladies and gentlemen. If I was Cashman, well, if I was Hal Steinbrenner, this is exactly what I would do to Brian Cashman and what's his name? Aaron Boone. Great work, Rob. Great work. See if you can read this. You're fired, and in case your ears are get the f out. And you know, <laughs> ain't nothing else much to say after that, man. This uh, this trade deadline was uh, terrible. It was horrible. This team is ass. I mean, it was just overall just really bad, man. I mean, <laughs> I work at Chick Fil A, right? And I'm doing a curbside delivery order. And it's uh it's about to be six o'clock. I go on my phone. I'm like, oh, the Yankees. You know, it's six o'clock trade deadline. Did we buy? Did we sell? Juan Soto is he a Yankee? Is Glaber still a Yankee? <laughs> Juan Soto isn't a Yankee, but you know who is? Kanan Middleton yeah! <laughs> from, from the damn Chicago White Sox. Thirty minutes later, oh, you didn't you didn't think that was enough? You didn't think the rental a uh, pitcher was enough? Who's gonna leave us after this season with like a three sixty nine ERA is enough? Oh. <laughs> Let's go get you Spencer Howard from uh from God knows where and I don't care because the dude has a 10 ERA. He's a bum. He's a bona fide scrub. And my goodness almighty, what are the Yankees doing, dude? I mean, <laughs> we have <laughs> we have uh the best relief reliever ERA in baseball. And we were going out here getting relievers because that's what the team needed. The team needed relievers. <laughs> Come on, man. I mean, Cashman did a presser and he said and I quote, I'm sure there's a lot of people out there that say tear it down and sell. And other people are out there saying to add something big. There wasn't a big thing to add. And to be quite honest, uh, that was going to solve the immediate problems that we had. Let's take that first half of his quote, right? So, so, so these two subpar, one subpar, the other one's just a bona fide scrub. Relievers are going to fix with the Yankees missing, right? You know, we have one good starter. We have a great starter. I love Garrett Cole. The rest of it, like, we have no good starters, dude. Cortez, all right, Cortez is coming back. You, you know, and then he also says, in terms of the sell stuff, there is certainly a lot of players that are talented that playoff teams would like to get their hands on. But in terms of trying to pry that away from us, it wasn't really worth it. 
it was like, I'd rather just keep it and take a shot. Take a shot at what? You want to take a shot at tequila? Because it sounds like you're drunk as hell if you really think that this team is going to pull through and make an insane playoff run. And you know what? I hope. I hope in October, late October, that I see this video and I'm like, yo, how did I not believe in this team? We're tripping because right now we're on pace for 84 wins this season that will probably not get us into the playoffs. And I hope I regret and I sound really stupid in late October because as of right now, I sound like the dude who has been like a broken record. I say the same exact thing over and over again because this team is ass. It is just absolutely embarrassing. It is terrible. Like the young philosopher once said, my friend Aubrey Graham, Aubrey Drake Graham. Embarrassing. <laughs> this has been embarrassing. You know, being a Yankee fan, I mean, you know, they probably look at Cortez and Lois Loisica coming back at the trade and they're like, oh yeah, these are our trade deadline acquisitions. Loisica's healthy and so is Cortez. No, dude, that's just, those are guys that are on your team. And then, you know, just overall, they don't play Bader, right? They don't play Bader the day of the trade deadline. And I'm thinking, oh, you know, maybe Bader's gone. That sucks. I want to trade a Bader. But hey, maybe we got something. No, we didn't. No, he, he didn't even get traded. He just didn't play that day. It's like, why are you teasing us? Like, What is wrong with you? And then, you know, the only guys that I wouldn't trade right now is Garrett Cole and Aaron Judge because, you know, they're great players. And I genuinely feel bad for them because, you know, Judge is a yankee he's a yankee captain and he's like he's what it means to be a yankee and garrett cole is the best pitcher in baseball right now i don't care what you say shane mcclanahan whoever the hell that is and I, you could you could give me whatever name you'd like to give i don't care the dude's on a tear i, I don't you know i think Eovaldi, i don't give a crap what that dude is doing <laughs> this cy young is going to cole and cole only so ladies and gentlemen just to be straight up this team freaking sucks. It's ass. And it's all because of Cashman's fault. Do something. Either you buy or you sell. But you can't just do what you did. Because you didn't get anybody. You got two relievers. And, and it, it took till the last hour of the deadline for you to make a trade. We were the only team out of all 30 teams, 29 teams, made a deal by 5 o'clock on August 1st. And it took us, it took us till literally 5.57 to make a deal. Embarrassing embarrassing guys and you know shout out to the mets for realizing that their team's ass so they just moved on and they just traded all the chips there and uh you know good luck to the angels now i want to see the angels do something with otani you know Bruh. who knows so are we gonna sign otani this offseason? season what's the plan what's the plan cashman you just plan to keep it this way are you gonna finally call up jason dominguez you know are you gonna call up austin wells <laughs> and i can't i was gonna go down the shore with my yankee jersey on this past weekend and i'm like hmm do I really want to be seen wearing this? And I was damn right. Because the team, you know, we got, we got superstars, guys. We just traded for two big superstars. Kanan Middleton, a guy who I've never heard of. And I play him will be the show every day. And freaking Spencer Howard. I, I don't even know who that is, dude. Like, <laughs> Spencer Howard? But thank you guys for watching. This has been the Jose channel. And if there's one thing that you could count on right now, is don't bet on the Yankees because I don't know what's going on. Enjoy, guys. Have a good one. Like and sub. And Brian Cashman needs to go. Peace.